Hello everyone. The, uh, today our topic is word processor, and uh, we'll discuss the purpose of word processor. The word processor is one of the most used uh, computer applications in education. There are basically four primary functions of word processor, which are number one is composing, number two editing, number three saving, and number four is printing. Word processing software uh, has been is defined as a word processor is a program that allows us to enter, format, save, and print text. Text are words and numbers. Microsoft Word is a popular word processing program uh, used mainly for creating documents, um, documents such as uh, brochures, letters, learning activities, quiz, tests, and students' homework assignments. <coughs> to open a, a new Word document, when creating a new document in the Word, you will often want to start with a new blank document. For this, uh, we open in, uh, it in, as a new uh, blank document. And after blank document, uh, we will click on create button and the new uh, word page is open now. Open Word, or if Word is already uh, open, select File from from, from New. Uh, number two is in the uh, search for online template box. Enter a search word like a letter, res uh, resume, or invoice, or select a category. Enter the search box like business, personal, or education. Click template and see the preview. The a preview is like this. Uh, in this uh, page, now. You are uh, looking at the interface of the word processor. In this word, below is the given up from uh, interface of Microsoft Word document 2007 when opened. In this uh, area, the first of all, this area is called Quick Access Bar. Uh, this area is known as Quick Access Bar, and uh, these are basically tabs, home tab, insert tab, tab uh, page layout, reference, etc. Uh, this area, document or two, is basically a, a title bar. And uh, this area is called window control. This is basically a ribbon. This side is called a vertical scroll bar, and the area below is called horizontal scroll. 